gentlemen, what's going on? 1247, a great one, man, gentlemen. It's, it's a great day to be great, man. It's, it's, oh, good God. <laughs> it's a great day to be great, brothers, man. Hope you guys are enjoying your day, man. You guys uh, go out here on this platform called Earth and be the greatest version of yourself, gentlemen. Don't be the greatest version of what the so called matriarch community is talking about. Be the greatest version of you. Understand? Now, gentlemen, check this out, man. Something just came. A little quick, simple message. It's about a, um, it's about the next generation. It's about the next generation. Those of you that have uh, children, and uh, what I'm personally doing with myself. I think I showed you guys uh, a couple of videos earlier that I've created. Well, I'm sorry. My my children and I. Uh, created a, 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 a clothing line or clothing uh, clothing collection because I have clothing line, you know, clothing line. You guys check me out. I'll leave the link in the bio. Twelve forty seven clothingcompany dot com. But I created a, a clothing uh, collection for my children, right? And the thing is, I'm, I'm getting at you, fathers, man. Question I got to ask you, gentlemen, is what? Are you creating for your children? What are you creating for your children? It's great about that, you know, you want them to go to college and this, that, and the third, but what as of today are you creating or are you, are you, or are you helping your children create? Are you helping your children create? Are you creating for your children? What are you leaving for your babies as of today? Not, not five, 10, when they hit 18, no. What are you creating for your children today? What kind of business, what kind of whatever you're doing, you're creating for your children or you're helping them create? You guys are creating together. I'm saying this right now, gentlemen. I'm doing this. I'm, I'm practicing what I'm preaching. I'm creating. I've created with me and my, my, my seven five-year-old, my two little girls, I've created a, a whole collection of their own clothing line collection. I created it. My my little one, she she seen. I created a. I had a shirt that I designed, and my, my at the time, you know, my oldest, my youngest is five, but she, when she gave me the idea, she was four. And she gave me idea about her uh, 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 an idea. And she gave it to me, and I had it created. Now they have their own clothing collection. Seven to five years old. I'm not waiting till they, they they hit 13, 18, 16. I'm not waiting till I'm not gonna wait another 10, 12 years now. I'm going to I'm going to start that generational wealth right now. Same thing with you, gentlemen. What are you doing to create generational wealth for your children right now? Seriously, right now, what are you doing to create generational wealth? It's great that you got a college savings fund. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not gonna knock that. But how, what business have you created or helped create with your children as of today? Have you created anything for your children? There's nothing wrong. You got insurance and trust funds and stuff like that. Insurance. I, I get that. That's cool. That's, there's nothing wrong with that either. But as far as a business, what have you created? with your children have you invested in your children's future have you invested in your children's imagination do you watch your children as they play are you even observing them as they play or as they as they do this as they do that are you are you uh um introducing them to new things i'm telling you right now i'm not i'm not listen i i my children ain't banging with the matriarch community they're just not I'm not. I'm not bringing those the matriarch talking points into my house. I'm not. I'm not. We we, we don't talk about that stuff. All oh, this and all oh, this and some white man got the foot on my. I'm not. I'm not talking about that in my house. Are you crazy? I observe my children and see what they're doing. Okay, cool. They like the, the YouTube videos. They like this. They like that. Cool. How can I create a business as of right now for my children? Because here's the thing, as you create for your children, that's in turn helping you also. You gotta, see, you gentlemen have to understand this, that people will get 
on board with children before they get on board with you. That's just, I mean, just let's, let's be honest with, with the, uh, I'm just going to be honest. So you helping yourself by helping them. Right? It's not like you're using your children, but you're getting them to to uh, uh, to get creative. You're getting them, you're you're getting them to uh, to to use their mind. Because I mean, look, listen, our children got wild imaginations. What I'm trying to do is cultivate that and trying to trying to create something lucrative for them, for well, for the family, basically. You know, something, you know, I mean, I know we all grown up and, you know, I, you know, if you had a father, you had parents, you know, they, you know, they did the best they could. So I'm not going to sit there and point the finger. Oh, they should have created. Okay, cool. They didn't. Listen, let's be honest. You know, nobody created nothing for me. Hell, nobody even encouraged me to create anything. But I mean, it's cool. I'm not bashing. You know, I'm not going to point the finger at my dad. Oh, my dad, you should have. Listen, he was doing what he was doing. You know, working and doing this thing, maintaining the cool. That's that's nothing. I, hey, that's that's all good. I'm I'm just taking. I'm just I'm just doing something that somebody didn't do for me. With no strings attached. Because my children, you know, if listen, my thing is, hey, listen, if I would just leave this 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 platform called Earth right now, can you can I mean have can you leave your children something tangible? Can your children make some? Can your children make money right now if you were to leave the earth? Have you created something for your children? If you were to drop dead like right this split second, how can your children make money right now? I don't care how big or small it is. I don't care if you got a lemonade stand, whatever. Like, how can your children make money as of today, right now? Have you shared some type of recipe with your children? Have you shared some type of song, some type of poem? Are you getting your children to write or to act or to, to, to whatever they're doing? Are you getting your children to create something so they can generate money or wealth like as of right now? Because let's be honest, we don't know how much time we got on this earth. We think, oh, we we, we think we got the next, we're we going to wake up tomorrow. You, you don't know that. As of right now, what have you created for your children? If you were to drop dead in the next 10 seconds, can your children take something right now? and make money right now. They can take an idea. They can take something as of today and make money today. This is what I'm saying, gentlemen. We've got to change our mindset about what life is really about. you got to snap out. you got to get out the so-called matriarch community, man. you got to separate yourself from the mediocrity. Gentlemen, we are builders by nature. We are creators and inventors by nature. I mean, come on, it's all through history. All through history. I don't care where, you know, I, I know in the so-called matriarch community, our matriarch, the so-called matriarch black community, they're not talking about this. Oh, fleekity fleek and liddy lid and hot girl summer and wop and all that dumb stuff. That's being praised in your so-called, you know, well, not my so-called, in the so-called matriarch black community. But gentlemen, we got to change our, we got to create our own narrative. Separate from the mediocrity and create your own community. And if you have children, start with your children. That's your community right there. Your community is your children starting out. You don't need 15 people and 50 people and 1,000 people. No, your children are the community, are the, are the start of your community. But if you're not giving your children, if you're not building anything with your children, if you're not you're not uh, uh, creating with your children like how do you expect the community to grow if you're not giving giving your so called your own immediate children nothing to work to have nothing for them to look forward to you're not giving your children anything you just come home you watch the game or, you know kick your feet back and get ready for the next day and play with your kids a little bit do some homework and go to sleep and do it again and next day and the next day so once again what are you creating for your children and what are you creating with your children is there something that you can give your children as of today that they can make money today or tomorrow me creating this golden line for my children they have their own character and 
Children, listen, people love children. Listen, you got lemonade stands. I mean, there's so many things that you can be creative that your that your children that your children can make money. They can make smoothies. They can make ice cream. I mean, there's so many things that you can do that you can give to your children that they can be creative and they can start making money. They can start generating their own little wealth. Have your own little business plan. Okay, cool, babies. All right, all right, cool. You sold this much this month. How much? What, what are we trying to do next month? See, now you get your children involved. Instead of just sending them to school all day and they learning some bullcrap ABCs and all this stuff, now you are teaching your children. You and, and you imparting your vision, your dreams, and things into your community, which is your babies, which is your children. But once again, are you are you doing that for your? Are you, are you even doing that for your children? Or are you too busy out here chasing big booty keys all day? We're not gonna invest in the children because oh, I'm just chasing. Oh, I'm just. I'm just trying. I'm just trying to see some titties. Really? Come on, gentlemen. Your community starts with your family. Fine. If you, listen, you like me and you got a female that's not banging with your program, that's fine. That's that's cool. But that's not gonna be but the relationship between me and her. Ain't got nothing to do with my two little girls. Listen, mommy want to go out here and do her thing. Cool. I'm not gonna listen. I'm not gonna stop your mother from from handling her business. Hey, man. Hey, listen. Do your thing. But as you out here playing the field and doing whatever you're doing, I'm I'm sitting I'm sitting with my two my two babies. That's my responsibility, and I'm creating for my two children right now. Once again, I don't know who's watching me. I don't know who's, 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 who's uh, what type of opportunities that can come about with my, uh, you know, uh, that, that can come about. Somebody can invest. Somebody can can make a, a investment. Can make a large purchase or something like that to, to 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 catapult my whole family to the next level. But if I'm sitting out here chasing titties, chasing at the chasing at the Chasing that the, uh, um, the 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 fatties, you know. If I'm if, if I'm if I'm chasing chasing that the uh, big booty Becky, same thing. Ain't gotta be Keisha Hell. It could be big booty Becky, big booty Marie. I mean, hey, all these women getting big butts nowadays. But I'm saying though, if I'm focused on 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 on, on chasing booty and titties all day, then once again, what? How can I complain about something that I'm not taking the time to create with my children? How do I complain about what's going on in, in the world and I'm, I'm not trying to create the change starting with my children? How can I show my children something that's different and I'm sitting there doing the same thing everybody else doing? Everybody else chasing after titties, I'm chasing after titties. Everybody else uh, chasing after big booty, I'm chasing after big booty. But then I'm going to sit there and complain about Oh, there's not enough change. There's not enough jobs, and this, that, and the third. Come on, see, see, gentlemen, we, we we can't do, we can't we can't be like the women. See, the women, that's what women do. Women complain all day because they want somebody else to fix their problem. You can't be like women and complain all day because nobody listens to when men complain. Like you can vent. But the next thing people want to see is, okay, cool. How do you create a solution to the problem? That's when people are willing to, to invest in you because now, okay, cool. There's an issue and there's a problem and there's a lack of this and there's a lack of that. But cool, I'm 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 creating this. I'm creating this with uh, I'm creating this. I'm creating the solution. I'm creating this. I'm creating that to uh, to offset the problem. And I'm doing it with my children. That's when people will be like, you know what? Cool. Let me let me put let me put a few dollars to to what you're doing. But if you gentlemen out here chasing at the titties and booty all day, then nobody's gonna invest in invest in you, and you're gonna sit there and complain about, oh my god, and the community and everybody's getting shot and all this dumb stuff. Come on, gentlemen. You have to get back to the basics. Your basics start 
with what are you creating? With your basics is basically your children. What are you creating or help create with your children? What are you doing to make their lives better? What are you doing to even empower them? Like I said, I got two little girls. You know, I can, I can, I can, I can princess and you a queen and all this. I can do. I can. I can say all that nonsense to them all day. But guess what? That's not helping empower my two daughters. What's going to empower my two daughters is them having their own business at a young age. So next three, four years from now, now, now they're in a business mindset. Now they're in a business mindset. So now they they can they can um with me, you know, we, we we can create some whatever. We can create this and create that. And see how far it goes. See, this is how you change the mindset. This is how you get to this is how you get your kids. This is how you get your kids out of sorcery. You wanna get your children to stop acting crazy? You gentlemen have to put the work in. You have to show the children something different. It's not up to the women, because the women will keep doing what they're doing. They've been doing it for the last 50, 54 years, since the 60s. They've been doing this for the last 50, over half a century. Over half, half a century, they've, they've been doing the same thing. These women are not going to change. I said it yesterday, gentlemen, you have to be the change. You have to be the change. The change is not going, nobody else outside of you is going to change your situation. For you and your family. Nobody's going to be the change. You have to be the change. That's why I tell you gentlemen. Always at the top of my videos. Get your mind off the behind. Stop chasing them titties all day. Stop chasing that big booty all day. Listen gentlemen. We got things to do. You got to listen. Your community starts with your children in your house. What are you doing to help them to get to the next level. And I don't want to hear that your daddy ain't do it for you. I don't care. My daddy ain't do it for me either. So, so, so what's the excuse? So what's the excuse? Oh, my daddy ain't. Okay, my daddy ain't either. So what, what are we talking about? And my daddy was in the house. In, in, in the house. So what, what are we talking about? I'm not using no more excuses. My, my, my parents ain't do X, Y, and Z for me. Cool. I'm not going to do that for my children. Oh, my father didn't create a business for me. Cool. That's cool. I'm not pointing the finger at him. Cool. But I'm not going to re re repeat the same cycle. Oh, I'm good. Okay, no, I'm, I'm not good. If, listen, if once again, if I were to drop dead today, what can? how can my children eat on their own? without relying on their mother. Yeah, the little clothing collection is something small, but gentlemen, everything that, 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 every tree starts with a seed. Everything starts small, gentlemen. Oh yeah, it's, well, yeah, you know what you're saying, bro, but man, that's gonna take time. Yeah, gentlemen, it's gonna, yeah, of course it's gonna take time. But it's putting in the effort to create something or help them to create something so somebody else can, uh, maybe you don't have the funds to, to, to make that thing explode. But if somebody sees your effort, somebody sees the message, somebody sees the, the, the impact you're trying to make, not only on your children, but other children too, to help, because you know, because their clothing line, to me, is helping, it can get other children to do the same thing. You know, my children can go to school with their own clothes, with their own clothing line. Like that's, you know how impactful that is amongst children? It's not, it, it shouldn't cause anybody to be jealous, but my children going to school with their own clothing line can, can impact the other babies to do the same thing. Your child go to school with their own, like, I mean, I got, 
you know, on the little website, I got their own, they got their own little book bags, they got their own pillows, all that stuff. Because the people I'm working with, they, you know, they supply all that stuff. But boom, boom. Listen, I supplied the uh, the logos and stuff like that for the for the different um, for the different items that's that's on the website, whatever. But I mean, gentlemen, you know how impactful that is for your child to go to school with their own book bag, with their own clothing line, with their own character. This is yours. But we gonna throw that opportunity away, and for 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 my children to get, impact the whole school. But I'm gonna throw that all away because I'm trying to chase after some damn titties all day. I'm gonna chase. I'm gonna chase after these uh, uh, these pogs, the, the big booty white girl. I'm gonna chase after these big booty white girls all day. I'm gonna chase after Maria and them all day. Come on, gentlemen. You got children sitting up in your house right now. That you can develop a video game, you can develop a, a whatever, a song, a dance, or whatever you, you can do with your children. You can develop something right now, and your children can go to that to that school and pack them, and pack all them other children. But we're not gonna do this because you're trying to you're trying to chase. You're trying to chase uh, uh, Big Booty LaRonda all day, right? Come on, gentlemen. Are we serious right now? But then we can sit around, we complain? When you could, you could make the change, like, right now. You can make the change right now. Change starts with you and your children right now. All 12, but, you know, her mom, okay, well, whatever. Fellas, listen, you can, you can, listen. Get your babies to give you some ideas. I'm not asking my children to draw the character. Listen, I ask my children a simple question. Babies, what, what kind of character do you want? Because I already got the one character is already up on the website. Cool. So, babies, what's the next character that you want? See, now I'm getting my children to work with me to create. Now I'm getting their now I'm getting their imagination. Now I'm creating now, now my this is how you teach your children how to be self-sufficient. Not about so much about independence, but being self-sufficient. This is how you tell. This is how you tell your children how to drink. This is this is why you tell your children. This is how you get your children. Uh, you show your children that you believe in their dreams. Man, it's gonna be emotional. This is how you get your children to believe in their dreams because if daddy's not going to believe then who's going to believe all right gentlemen because if daddy's not going to believe in my dream then who else is going to do it Who else is going to do it, gentlemen? Ah, but it doesn't matter because I'm chasing titties all day. Who else is going to believe in your children? You get your children to give you ideas because you're telling your children, I believe in what you're thinking. I believe in what you're thinking, baby. Now, you don't have to keep going out here and putting on football pads. You ain't got to go out here and always playing basketball and doing this just to waste of time. No. Hey, baby, well, hey, what, what are you thinking about? What's going on? Now you're getting into your children's life. Now they, now they can come to dad and be like, hey, dad, this is what I'm thinking. And you turn around, whatever, it doesn't matter if you got uh, millions of dollars or a couple dollars in your pocket, you try to make that happen. You try to create that prototype. With the help of your children. Because now you're getting you telling your children, I believe in you. Shoot, if mama don't believe in you, it doesn't matter. 
I believe in you. To help your daddy out. What, 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 what's going on in your mind? What are you thinking? What is this? You know, they're young, seven and five, but you know, hey, I'm, I'm hey baby, what kind of what kind of character do you want to see? You know, my eldest is, is giving me give me a couple characters. Cool. So now I'm gonna take her ideas and I'm about to go produce it for her. I'm about to produce it because now she's helping me because I'm not going to come out with the characters. I'm like, babies, listen, I told my children, I'm not, listen, daddy's not going to create the characters for you. But if you give me the idea, then I can go and, 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 and so I got many people that do, does the, the, the drawings and I got many people that I'm contracted all over, all over the world that's doing uh, cartoons and all this other stuff. They don't have to do that. But this is what I'm saying, gentlemen. We keep talking about these children don't listen. These children out here, they're doing what they want to do. No, don't point the finger at the children. Point the finger at yourself. You're not asking these children what they think. And you're not asking these children what they believe in, what's your dreams, and this, that, and the third. Nah, because you're sitting there chasing goddamn Keisha all day. We at the club. Popping bottles all day. But then got the nerve talking about some of these kids don't want to listen. Just by asking your child or hell, if your child is somebody else's child. Hell, I started a comic book company last year. You don't think I'm not trying to, you know, trying to get these babies, trying to come up with characters? What, what, what if I can, uh, you know, get, get some more, get my money up, get, you know, start publishing. Now I, 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 I can, I can offer children something. I, I can give children hope because somebody believes in what I'm saying. Somebody believes in what I'm saying. Somebody's just not talking. Oh yeah, kids, and what do you want to be when you grow up? Blah 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 blah. Okay, all right, bye bye. Some celebrity, no, 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 no. I, I make an impact. I'm making an impact. I don't care. I don't care if it's one child or a million children. I'm making an impact. It's not about the dollar and the cents. I'm getting my. I'm getting these kids to believe in themselves, to believe in the things that they that's going through their mind. Yes, it's important. To, yes, it's important. Yes, baby, we need that. We need that idea. Yeah, baby, we need your idea. We need your imagination. I need that. To tell me what you're thinking, I'll go ahead and produce it, and boom. You can show you all your little friends. You got your own clothing line. You got your own teddy bear. You got your own little doll. You got your own little character. You got your own little G.I. Joe. You got your own this. You got your own that. You got your own sneaker. You got your own little tablet. You got your own whatever. That's what you're supposed to be doing, gentlemen. You don't point the finger and say, oh, these women ain't doing X, Y, and Z. No, it's up to you to change, to make the change. The community starts with your children. Get your mind out the behind and get back to these babies. Get back to these babies. Get back to the babies, gentlemen. I'm sorry, I'm Shut a tear, but man, it made me emotional, man. Like it's, I, it's, it's funny because you, you're doing it, but you don't. You don't. It's like sometimes you don't think the impact of what, what you're doing to your own children. You, you, I'm asking my children, what kind of characters do you want? I'm observing my children as they play and they do this and they do that, and I'm I'm sitting there trying to configure things and trying to get them to make more videos and things of that nature. Now I'm getting my children to believe in themselves. My children can go to school with their own, with their own, with their own uh, uh, clothing line collection, and they can go back to their kid. They can go back to their school and show other kids that, hey, listen, my daddy created my own, my own. My my daughter told her teacher she got her own uh, uh, clothing line collection, and they can show the kids not to be braggadocious, but just just to, to encourage other babies to to do the same thing. Ask your parents the same thing. But anyways, man, I'm not my bad, man. That's yeah, listen, I'm just emotional right now. But yeah, man, get back to them kids, man. Like, share, subscribe. Peace.